I'm Shama Ramani, the founder of Friend in Need India Trust or FIN. FIN was created in the aftermath of the Asian tsunami of 2004. It emerged out of adopting a village to make sure that everyone in the village had access to life's essentials. Over time, it first started focusing on sanitation. But then I didn't know about World Toilet Day till I joined uh, the United Nations University. I'm an ac academic, an economist. But still, I find that we have always celebrated toilets, safe toilets, because that is the way to get this behavioral change from open defecation to usage of toilets. To celebrate the toilet, in fact, our first was the toilet beauty contest. How do you get men in a village to use toilets when they prefer the beach? So we created a beauty contest with nice rewards, but the rule was that the men should also use the toilets for the families to participate. This led to many families, many men in the village experimenting with toilet usage and finding it's not so bad after all. Then over time, it was discovered that many of these toilet structures were not climate resilient and they were not made out of good quality and they had many design defects. So another of our toilet celebrations was innovation contest. And we discovered that rural masons in, in rural India, they actually learn through doing and many of them don't know the right way to do things. And yet they are very creative uh, for they came up with many, many innovations. So after addressing the, the demand, creating a demand and addressing the supply side, it was necessary to create this critical mass of people to use toilets. And that's where we started combining festivities with sanitation. And at this point in 2011, I also discovered by this time that there was a World Toilet Day. So it was put under the World Toilet Day festivities, giving it somewhat more legitimacy as the entire world was supposed to be celebrating the toilet. And we started combining it with events for children, with events of beautification of public spaces, with opening our speciality toilets, which is the ecological toilets, urine diverting dry toilets. And still it wasn't enough because to get this movement of change from top to bottom, it is really necessary to educate. That's how the third mission of FIN developed. Okay, the second being to share our learnings with the academic community. The third became to train all stakeholders in sustainability, notions of sustainability, circularity, safety, empathy, to create safe toilets because we feel still there are millions of toilets, ill-constructed toilets that are going to contribute to points of contamination in the future. So we started these fun workshops. We developed a workshop notion and this was actually implemented by volunteers in different parts of the world. So I was very happy to see I was very happy to see how it was giving rise to ideas in different parts of the world, including the developed world. And we also started reaching out to experts because by this time, there were so many people working on innovation and behavioral change. So we have had some excellent webinars also. So now you see, we are doing a multitude of activities. It is no longer a celebration. It is a festival.